The same number of G is far more dangerous in one direction than another. This is why the seating orientation and posture of astronauts matter so much. Lying on their backs spreads the load over a large area and keeps the height of the body in the acceleration direction small. That minimizes internal pressure gradients. Your heart does not need to pump uphill through meters of fluid under multiplied weight. Your skeleton is also naturally built to handle forces along your spine better than forces trying to bend you sideways. So, 3G for several minutes, chest to back, is within what human tissue and circulation can tolerate, even though 3G straight from head to feet for the same time would likely be lethal. The rocket doesn't magically make the force gentle. It carefully lines it up with the directions your body is best at surviving. Rockets themselves are engineered around these limits. A rocket engine delivers thrust, a push, almost like a very focused, continuous explosion. That thrust is roughly constant during a stage burn, but the rocket's mass is not. As fuel is spent, the total mass drops. Since acceleration is the force divided by the mass, the same thrust acting on less and less mass produces more and more acceleration. 